we no longer have a past. Perhaps we would not feel this so painfully if there were not people who still have a past from which they derive their standard for tomorrow. And they seem to be the stronger ones, so we really should follow their example. Oh, what a fruitless effort it is to make their goal our own. And so, the world is divided in two parts, and between them lies an invisible abyss that both sides are aware of. The people on either side have begun to hate each other, without wanting to, and without any fault of their own, although each would like to hold the other responsible. How often, when I ask one of the victims about someone who I know was their friend, do I hear the answer, he's finished for me. We no longer have a past. We have become a present. We have slipped away from the pressings of time. Time still keeps watch over us. She orders us to work and calls us to lunch, and we obey. <laughs>